Swamp. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. This is where it begins, I guess. Okay, I guess we just do this to gain some life points first. Add some counters here. And then we have the revival revenge on top. Yep. And you know what? I mean, I wish I had another sorcerer in hand. That would be amazing, but... Yeah, we're gonna get two of these. By the way. Wink! 68. 136. Okay, okay. Oh my god, we have another thousand year storm on top of us. Denyar! This is another Denyar deck. And more than that... Oh, I forgot a new haircut! And I don't want to show you... But I went into the wrong saloon, and I got the women's haircut. <laughs> That's what it's gonna look like. Looks so weird. Anyways, you're gonna see that when we get into the games. It'll be a nice surprise. <laughs> see my weird haircut. Uh, anyways. <laughs> I'm gonna hear the story also about it. Anyways, today we're playing very much a senior deck. This is the Thousand Year Storm. Plus Revival Revenge. Plus Bola Citadel, of course. It's basically the idea behind deck is I thought, what if I have Thousand Year Storm down? And I have Bola Citadel, and I just play Revival Revenge and play my celebration from the top. I'm gonna gain a silly, silly amount of life with this. And yeah, we're gonna gain a silly, silly amount of life with this. And if you're also adding Vito, we can of course also kill our opponents. It's kind of good to not just gain silly amount of life, to also have some way of winning the game. Kind of good. Uh, and Revival Revenge as it so happens can return the Vito from our graveyard and play with Celebration can of course also return uh, Vito from the graveyard and gain of course the amount, amount of life. Uh, we're gonna go into the Cyborg Recarn. Uh, we're gonna pick up our Bola Citadel. We don't have much to survive. We have Shatter the Sky. We have Karuga which I guess we could block with. And we have the Mana Stones to get the Manas, the insane Manas we need for this deck. Let's jump. Into the game. New haircuts, says everyone. Yes, my wife cut my hair. Usually, when I cut my hair, I do it myself. I just put it up like this and a ponytail. Uh, but now I got some help. <laughs> she really liked it because it was her first time. I was like, first time? Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's just how I roll. Just how I roll. T. Dot yup. Oh my god. Do not be escaping now. Ember Hauler. Interesting, mister. Interesting. I think we gotta put this down on... I oh, actually need white, so I'm gonna put it on white. And see. TDU. I think this can be so amazing if we get our things off her. What the fuck is this? What can I do, even? Discard your hand until another turn whenever a creature control power 2 or less. This combat damage a player draw a card. That seems amazing, mister. Truly, truly amazing. Well, put on you. I guess we could just double our life total. We could just revival revenge next time. Ah, that could be pretty. We have three of them. <laughs> I think we're gonna get a silly amount of HP with this. Silly, silly amount of HP. Uh, what other color might be? There? I guess blue. Why not? We will revenge. Double our life total. Blinks, yes. Go up to 32. It's kind of nice. <laughs> oh, I love this. Just such a noob magic when you just... Oh, Boltown. Oh, he's... He's dealing all that damage, isn't he? Okay. Ooh. Six damage. Oh, we got to double again, though, so... Oh, my God. Okay. I could play this. I mean, he's just gonna kill it. <laughs> Let's just be honest. We're up to 52. <laughs> Problem on the red? Problem? Flash Tauser. Okay. Okay, that's cool. Um, that's what I think we'll do this time, though. <sighs> Frack, we just need to shut this guy, don't we? Yeah. Shut this guy. Clear up his Mastiff and his Boltown. And that Brash Tauser, though, we kind of want to. Uh, kind of want to play Vito. And then play this. That would be amazing, of course. <sighs> ah, okay, we, we put it down there. I don't think this is gonna work out. I have a sneaking suspicion it's not. Mink. It's into our hand. And Vito you know, is so done, I am. And it's gonna exile it. Yep. Frack. Now we can't even return it with the revival revenge. It's fine, though. 
Because we gotta find another. Definitely gonna find another. And also we gotta go up to like a million HP right now. Uh, yeah, that's double. <laughs> you got down to two. We're up to 90. <laughs> this feels good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, it's... Let's start working on that. Okay, it doesn't. Start working on that life total. <laughs> that's what I was about to say. Um, let's see here. Ah, big bit of the blue, honestly. Oh, wait, I shouldn't. Because if I buff this guy, uh, then he will deal more damage with Brash Taunter when he fights it. Ah, that's actually a dingus play. Actually, a dingus play, because now he can deal more damage. Yes. Now we can do the 6 per turn. <clears throat> and that will still take him a long time. A long, long time to kill me, but, you know, it's more doable. Uh, okay. Temple of Silence, yes. Yes, that's exactly what I want to up. Heraldic Banar. Uh, I think we put this on um, red this time. And we don't want to clear, we don't want to attack in, so. Let's pass turn. He's a brash taunt. He's a It's gonna feel good though when we get the ball set up. And it feel quite good. Quite good. Okay. So tap you, 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 you. We won't have enough black left over, that's all right. So I'm doing this if you're wondering. And Karn McDorn coming down on the board. Just me, or do I look like one of the members in Backstreet Boys? I guess not as handsome, maybe, but. <laughs> but I don't know. Kind of what it feels like with this haircut. I feel like I've been transported back to the 90s. And I've joined a boy band. <laughs> okay. He just gave up. He got him. Got him. Opponent goes first. We have the weirdest hand known to mankind. Could we? I think we could make it happen with this hand. You know, if we find another land, I think we could make it happen. One plus one plus one equals seven. <laughs> yeah, I mean, if you don't care about logic, sure. That you can make any, any calculation. E the equal sign doesn't mean much without logics. Does it? <laughs> we gotta do some, some dingus discussions today. Does the minus sign have a lot of meaning? Or the minus, the uh, the equal sign, without uh, logics? We have a lot of life gain in this, though. So I think even though if we go down low, if we can at least get one of our spells off, I think we're in good shape. A lot of life in this. It's part of my harm. We're actually in trouble. <laughs> we're actually in trouble. Okay, well, we'll put down this. 15. Uh, yeah, I mean... He's pushing out a lot of damage. Can I somehow survive next turn? Four, five, six, e yeah. <laughs> Turns out I can. Turns out I can, yes. Yes. Does he have a way of doing something? Yes. That's good, perfect. Check top card, mana geo, that is fine. Oh wait, no, I don't want it there, because I want a land on top. Because I have two of these, yeah, that was... That wasn't super smart, actually. I actually just bought them this. Okay, follow the Death Dweller. Gets a 5 5 and a 1 1. Uh, that could be dangerous. Could be very dangerous. I think we unfortunately have to play this. That's the bad part. And. Okay. <laughs> okay. I am a greedy bastard, yes. I put the green. Put it on green. Man, if it had a land though. If it had a land on top, that would have been so sweet. Sweet. We got out the two, but we have plain white celebration. So if it doesn't add too much to this, we can heal up a lot there. Heal up a lot, a lot. Whoop. Lot of life gainers. Oh. Up to 18. Ah, that's decent. Definitely decent, I would say. Definitely decent. 
Uh, we can get rid of the demon also next time with Karn, which is kind of nice. Uh, because we'll go minus into the side one. Hopefully, I put in the glass casket there. Uh, usually. Uh, usually. Usually, usually do it. Okay, he has something here in his hand. For five manas. Instant speed. Oh, I, I think he also runs revenge or something. He just have a sneaking suspicion he runs this card. Because why did we get mashed against this? It's probably because he also has this card. Probably. Oh, we'll see. Okay, smacks him. I'm gonna 12. And now... He has nothing. Okay, that's amazing, amazing. Not gonna complain about that. Corn, Great Schneeater. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Can we also get up to the Thousand Years Torment? That would be so That would be so so amazing. Okay, but minus two. My noose, my noose, my noose, 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 noose. Okay. It's gotta do something, isn't it? I mean, of course, it's gonna do something, but, it, you know, what I'm saying. Glass Casket. Let's see, can I play this and Glass Casket? Yes, if I put it on white, so let's put it on white. Heraldic Banner. White. And Glass Casket. Take away that 5-5. Five five. I think we're gonna turn the game around now. I think we're gonna turn it around. Okay, take away the 5-5. Five five. Take him away. Okay. Now all we need is the Thousand Year Storm and the Bowler Citra. <laughs> it's not the easiest to get off without the uh, Fire Submission. Man, this deck would be easy with the Fire Submission. I mean, that's like every deck. There is always another fire. Oh, Mister, you didn't. <laughs> that's a failure. Mister. You did not just do that thing, Mister. Okay. Do we double and go up to 20 HPs? To survive a little bit longer. Um, we could do this thing first, because it gives more HP actually. Uh, and we could return Karn also. We could do two life gains, three life gains, and one return. And return Karn. Wink. And the thing is, we did only have one glass casket though. We can use the glass casket as a blocker. Mm. Mm. We kind of need another board wipe. Right? I need that. Okay, 17. We are gonna be able to double though. The life points. Oh, no, 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 no. It's fine. It's fine. We draw the board wipe right when we need it. Ace it. Ace it. Murder's Rider shuffles in. This guy comes down. Pick up the Citadel. Yep, yep. Now we're off to. I think honestly, life gain is kind of strong right now. Because most things are aggressive. The things that I'm up against, at least, are aggressive. And if you just have enough life gain, you can just, you can just survive anything. Just play on. Oh no. Oh no. Because this is a weird deck, but it kind of works out because it has a lot of life gain. Call Death Dweller. Oh no! Oh no! This touch. This touch! Okay. Ma Gurns. Do we have a lot of things? I think we'll put this down first. Bola Citadel. And then we check the top card. We don't want that planes on top. Don't want that planes there. No, no, no. <laughs> Frack, I knew it! I knew it, it's fine. fine. We can revenge next turn, double our life total. And that should be good. He smacks him. He gets a little bit of a counter there. And, do you have something? Planner cleanse? Uh, I guess if you have planner cleansing in this position, you probably play it though. Uh, we probably want to double our life total first. So, revenge. Yep. Yep. Then we can play this from the top. Shwink. Put this on white, maybe? 
Or now nah, we put it on blue because we might need to play Karuga actually. And do we revenge again? Or do we just play Karuga macro? I think we just play Karuga macro. Draw one, two, three, four, five, six cards. Yeah, that, that is kind of good. Kind of good. I think I'll take that. Oh my freaking gunners. <laughs> okay. Okay, discard two. What are we gonna discard? We're gonna get discard Godless and the Swamp Bear. Okay. He probably has removal for Karuga, but now we can probably get another Thousand Years Door. And that's when things start getting silly. Okay, only with that thing. Okay, and it had Metasaurus. That's, that's fine. That's fine. Not that I would have blocked that thing. But... Swamp. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. This is where it begins, I guess. Okay, I guess we just do this to gain some life points first. Add some counters here. And then we have the Revival Revenge on top. Yep. And you know what? I mean, I wish I had another sorcerer in hand there. That would be amazing, but... Yeah, we're gonna get two of these. By the way. Wink! 68. 136. Okay, okay. Oh my god, we have another thousand year storm on top of us. Yep, that was kind of nice. This deck just has amazing hands every time. Temple of Silence Mountain. Dramatic Lantern. Chat this guy. Thoughts New Storm Revival. I mean, this just looks amazing. You take that plane one. I think we just want it on top in most cases. We just want it on top when we have the bowler set on. So, they can ship it away. Runaway Schneemgen. Unsurprising, I guess. Uh, put this down. We'll at least get the chat this guy. Quite soon, but he could kill us before we get off the chat this guy. So. Okay, now the runaway Schneemgen. That's looking very scary. Ah, smacks in. And does something with this, no? Yeah, so next turn he could really go off, but, you know, we can't do anything about it, so. We just put down a chromatic light and hope and pray. But that's all we can do. I draw all we can do now. Down land and hope he doesn't have something which protects against board wipes, which is only one card. A thing which... Oh, what's it called? Oh, wow, that's completed. Right? Unless he has haste on that. He probably doesn't. Okay, we go down low, but, you uh, know... I have, a, I have a feeling this is gonna be bad. Okay. Does that now. Which is good for us. And the incinerator also. Man, he had a lot of stuff here. And... The, oh yeah, that's a pretty good hand. I'm sorry I have this, but... Uh, no. <laughs> Feels pretty good when you have it. Yep. Uh, let's see here. Four, five, six. We can double our life total next time. That's cool. Okay, we're down to eight though. We can go up to 16, I guess. Which is probably gonna be good. Because we're higher than him. <laughs> At least there's that. No, not Torben! What a top deck! Oh my god! Okay, how do we get rid of that then? Oh, we're dead. We're dead. That top deck Torbrand, top deck Chandra. If you just drawn something normal there. Ah, uh, would have been fine. Nah, we did, there's no way of surviving here. He got us. He got us. We have the manas. All you need in the world is the manas. You have the manas, you have everything. Everything you possibly need. <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> Voice. Irritated my... <coughs> my everything. Ever. Okay. Serrated Scorpion. That's kinda cool. Put down the Temple of Sa... Oh wait, so I did not need another lamb. Don't need another lamb, but I kept it. Kept that box. Why not? I think we need another lamb. It, it's gonna... It's gonna show in the future that we need that lamb. It's gonna be crucial. Crucial, I said. For a coming turn, sir. Let's do the uh, double scratch. I should probably play this it also. Man. Man, I'm playing so sloppy right now. Man. Man. <laughs> oh, we, gotta, we could scry twice, though. Or. Nah. The, the thing is, I don't think we go for this. 
I don't think we go for it. Or do we? <laughs> oh, we should. Uh, no, no. We need this when we have the Citadel. When we have the Citadel, we go for these things. Now we just go Karoon Gap. I think that's about That's where we need it. Okay. Ah, that's good. We don't need to attack him to ever kill him. That's perfect. San Eldor. Eld Elder. San Eldor. Okay. Well, well, well. Put you in hand. Draw three cards. Nice. Oh! Nothing. <laughs> How nice! Give us nothing. Okay. A little menace. The Tooch and Loof Link. And Sir Aethel. I mean, might as well knock, I think. Do you have a death pack healing thing? No. A little bit of damage. That's fine. That is fine. I'm gonna put down you. And put down you. Name blue. And. Yeah, yeah, again, I should have probably shuffled to get some cards out of my deck. Here. So we have all the manas now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 manas. You should have kept the expensive cards there. Yeah, but you kind of need corn. <laughs> we kind of need corn for this to really work. I think I'll take one. I think I'll take one. Keep the Garugas. Keep the Rugas. Rackers? MacDackers. I guess we start shuffling. Getting lands out of the deck. Okay. Uh, well, we'll uh, revenge them. Uh, no attacks. San Alder up against all the manas in the world. Will we be able to get through all the manas? He's still just suicide with that scorpion. Cards he does not care about. Oh, he has manas now. Okay, sure. Okay. It's gonna take forever for him to get us. So. Please, there's that. Okay, another land, of course. Of course! Not a problem. Not a problem at all! Not that many left, though. Three. Three little basics. In that there deck. I mean, he has a lot of malice himself, to be fair. Though. Don't think he needs a lot of malice himself. Okay, come on now. Yes! There it is! There it is! Finally! Okay. Okay. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. You know what? I'll, I'll draw a card from this. I'll do it. Okay. Put this down. Tapped. Rack. <laughs> and nothing. We get nothing for this. Okay. We get a Temple of Silence next time. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18! Some kind of record! Okay. That's fine, though. Not a problem. Got them ready, sir. I kinda wish I had the board wipe. That would be sweet. That would be really sweet. Okay, now put down you. Oh, yes. Yes, we want to keep that. That we want to keep. Yes. Yes. Double life total. Sure. Need to put the rotten ready sword away. But I think we can survive this. Right? We can survive this. <laughs> and me, the awesome. <laughs> Stand down. Oh, is there any way we can gain life with this? I don't think there is. Uh, we probably need to go for the glass casket. We're so close to that. So close to that. Put away the rotten ready sword. Rotting Regisaurus. Oh, we can activate this and win. Oh, I didn't think about that. That's kind of good. Kind of good. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Weird victory. Oh, we got him. Oh, I want to dance with somebody. I want to feel the heat with somebody. You see that true fake that I did? Everyone's like, surely it's the heat. You won't feel the heat. Just. Yes. <laughs> I said yes. Sometimes I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing, but I know that I'm facing up against the Paradise Jewel. That's all I need to know there. Wilder's Reclamation. Okay. Well, that is. Uh, that could be dangerous. 
doesn't have canoeders though. And that I'm very helpful. So, found this. Is it Wilder's Reclamation Creatures? That one could be. Wait, maybe I should have taken land though. Maybe should have. Yeah, probably should have taken land. That would be smirk. Very, very smirk. Sunder Shaman. Okay. Well, that can actually destroy a lot of things. So, nah. 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 Man, I almost hit that uh, perfect pitch there, I think. Xevious. Circular's route. Okay, so it's. Gr Why do you have uh, this, though? You don't have instants with this? No? It's something like I would do. Like, I have this with some weird card in the back, just because it's. Just cool. Way too cool for a skill. Huh? And Carny Boy. Ah, we need El Citadel, I think. El Citadel. Citadel, you Okay, Xevious. He's gone for the root. He has a little bit of ramp, he has a little bit of sun, he has a little bit of everything. Okay. 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 Sarkin's Catharsis, that's his instant. Didn't you? <laughs> it didn't use it with Wilder's Reclamation, though. But, still, you had it. You thought it through. That's all you need. You thought it through, that's good. Uh, okay. Well, put down you. Don't think we need that guy. Okay, planes. Back. Oh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We're getting everything over. Um... And Vito? I think we have to kill him next turn if we have Vito. If he doesn't kill our Vito, though. I think he has it. I think he has some counter removal spell for Vito. Okay, when Silverback Shaman dies, he draws a card. And Adventurous Impulse. What are we playing against? <laughs> Erratic Cyclops? Oh, am I playing myself? Kind of what it seems like. Oh, well. We'll gain life points. I mean, I mean, he had a cool deck, and he maybe he had something really cool planned with this, but... But, we got him. Good. Then your shout out! Then your shout out! Then your shout out! <laughs> Thank you, every senores and senoritas for watching. And a special thank you, of course, to all our senor members and senorita members! Oh! <laughs> thank you so much, too! Adam Alexis, Simon Lauer, Rodney Cox, Herman Monson, Soft Pillow, Shamanics, Alice, Mike, and Nathaniel Listed, Laser Set the Stun, Topless Mentor, W. Lutz, 1978, Peter Gold, John Stevens, Gabriel Juvenal, Way, Mesa One, Ye Old Bassist, Tai Tai, Yulai Moonlight, Star Draker, 2000, Jurassic Fart, Invoke Legion, Yon Domian, Gesasaki, Own77, Ellie Curtis, Noah BH, MC Hermes, Fumiaki Kinoshita, J Cap, Steve Drominski, Strange Bronti, Sky Super Zero, Tim Dutton, Jake Danley, Demac Duncan, Relgan Chase, Closed, Honsa Cos, Agony Reborn, Ramen Noodles for Me, Nether Vex, Musketeer, Tom Cute, Michael, Name the Appetite, Dear Lurgraf, Dimly Tight, Stricker Mike, Mandosaurus, Michael Capito, Quan To Ying, Vincent Bodet, Paul Robert Miller, Anthony Nixon, Ninja Astral Optimus, Michael Shatterson, Dan McShaw, Pocky You, P Magic Pistol Man, Seppi1310, Martin Newman, Catherine Leuchtgeld, That's Mr. Got to You, Jake Palmer, Thomas Schwartz, Kyle Hoff, Rudy Robinson, Robert Montgomery, Salim Proctor, Once Truth365, All the Time, Jason Ellison, Zach Koila, QGL889, Matthias Pauli, Some Call Me George, Paris Hammond, Bill Murray, Charlene Eaton, Matt D, Kyle Wedgwood, Patrona Bavarie, Simon Fairley, Shimoda Masaya, Robert Barker, Adam Jacob, Fernando Vizu Leth, Dr. Leios, Robert Lewis, Link is Weak, Podrick the Wanderer, MTG, Verocta, Santa John, Geek General, Educator, Embracer of Knowledge, Dan McGoodsell, Aaron Noble, Drew Styles, Adam Alexis, Matthew Goggins, Bet Suma, Serge Caramado, Freeman Stephenson, Brandon Dobbs, DBK Drummer, Rainbow Cake, Eventum Tantum, Piotr Stalorch, Super Noodle 7, Ninja Long Gnome, Infinite Draw, Dr. Jaden, Javier Diaz, Red Khan, Adam Ruth, Barbara McKenley, Butt with us, Big Bob MTG, Jack Ren, Patrick Henning, Liquid E, Thanatos, Nesmoth, Truman, Jellybean, Patrick Parks, Parkin Newman, Jonathan Burgess, James Hazel, Daniel Williams, Harshit Singh, Eat It, Alexander G, Valencia, Lochinator, Travis, Markley, Grinning Demon, Mario Morales, Frank Sherwood, Farron, Skydy, Disquidus, I Ate My Neighbor, Yuto Ayase, 
Christopher Tonkin and Kakarot777. You guys are all amazing. If you also want to become an amazing member, then why not check out the join button next to the subscribe button or check out my Patreon. Link in the description. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so much to all our Patreon members supporting this video. If you also want to become a Patreon member, support me, and maybe even get a bigger snack, <laughs> then why not check out the Patreon link down below. And while you're here, you might enjoy one of these videos. These are the videos that Google say you like.